Well, I used to work with this electrician and he had an accident. At the time, he was an electrician for 22 years. And I go through the whole story and, you know, this is what happened. This was going on that day. This was the job. And then when it's all over, I roll up my sleeves and say, so it looks like my hands healed pretty good, didn't they? I was working on a 480 volt uh, motor control center bucket. I was trying to make a minor adjustment to the outside operating handle. And when I did that, I had the door of the MCC bucket open. I did not have gloves on. And I was using an uninsulated screwdriver and the screwdriver slipped and contacted C phase and it contacted it to the, to the breaker handle mechanism bracket. And when that happened, it drew an arc flash that propagated to all three phases and blew out onto me. I was in the hospital for three days. I was off work for three months because my doctor and in his infinite wisdom said, you look like the kind of guy that's gonna go out and bang up his hands and get an infection. So I'm gonna keep you home for an extra month. And this is a point that I wanna to make to people when they talk about PPE being hot. It's hot, it's uncomfortable, I said. It's not as hot as an arc flash. It's not 3,000 degrees. The, the main thing that I would say to anybody doing electrical switching or electrical work is PPE works if you use it. Granted, it's the last line of defense, but I'm here to tell you that it works. It worked on me where I had the FR rated or now the arc flash rated shirt and clothing, nothing happened. Where I didn't is where I got burned. One of the things that people said to me was, I can't believe that happened, that arc flash happened to you because you were one of the people that trained people on how to do switching safely. You were one of the people that insisted people use their PPE and you would gig them because they didn't have the stuff with them. And people said, of all the people that I thought this would happen to, I never thought it would be you. So don't fool yourself into it can happen to me. It's safe as you are and as regular as you are with using PPE, it's gotta be all the time every single time, all the time, you gotta use what'll protect you and keep you safe.